Thursday things we're making Thursday things we're making Thursday yeah Hi everybody, my name is Shannon and you're watching another yarn. Thank you so much for joining my channel. I greatly appreciate it. While you're here, hit the thumbs up, the like button, the subscribe button, all those things, all those cool YouTube people talk about. I don't know, I'm brand new, I'm just learning. So, it'll be fun. Anyway, you're here because it's Thursday. Things we're making Thursday, yeah. You got it after that nice catch jingle. Gets me every time. I did not make that, just did. There's a collaboration of a bunch of YouTubers. We've gotten together and we are making one free pattern every month. And we go over that and we look at what yarns did we use? What colors? What's my interpretation of the pattern? What did I change? What did I not change? All that wonderful stuff. So this is a bucket hat. The pattern calls for raffeta yarn. With all this stuff here, I don't have any raffeta yarn and I didn't want to go get any, so I didn't. And I am making mine out of cotton and uh, I think it's wonderful. How beachy perfect is this? Oh my goodness, I love it. It's not done yet. I did not do the super defined ridge. Remember we were talking about that last week and what I was going to do with this? So I didn't do the super defined ridge. I did put it on there and I didn't like it. So that was easy to take care of. So I just ripped it all out. Well, not all of it, but I just ripped back that little bit. So I just made regular, uh, this is all half double crochets and didn't do any increases and everything. And that's why we were able to make the length of this. I did not make it as long as I did on the last one. So it does round out on my head more so. I am continuing with my... Um, seam here and I think I'm doing a really good job. It's not a huge jog. It's not super defined like a lot of things do get when you're uh, changing colors on row to row. This is how I'm carrying my yarn up the side. I have increased more. I believe the pattern has you increasing four stitches per round. I increased six because I want it to flare out just a little bit more. And I also made the crown of mine larger than what the pattern called for because I'm not using the raffeta. This second dark blue is the 64 stitches around when it goes around all the way. And obviously I did another four rounds increasing the eight stitches per round. So I've got quite a few more. Not a problem. All the stuff, the spirit of the pattern is still intact. Look at that. I really like this. I think it's going to be fantastic. It's not done yet, obviously. I've got some more rows to go. I'm going to continue to make it a little bit bigger. And I think since I have plenty of, oh, I have plenty of yarn left. This is just some of my scraps, right? I might make a flower. I think so. Yeah. I'm going to make a flower or something. Maybe one or two of them that I can put right here. And uh, maybe I'll attach them with a pin so they can be removable, something like that. But just that extra flare kind of an accent. I like that idea. And uh, I'm going to flare this out a bit more than what the pattern calls for. I'm enjoying this. I really like this stripe more than I thought I would. I like the beachy feel to it. I like the just it, it screams go outside in the sunshine, right? You've got this yellow and orange and then the two different colors of blue. Oh my gosh. Absolutely perfect. So how's yours? Have you made one? Are you going to make one? Did you use raffeta yarn? Or are you going to use something else? Have fun. There's no rules in it. You can do anything you want to. You can create it however you want to. It's your project. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this episode, this, this particular version of Things We're Making Thursday have a great day. It has been such a joy talking to each and every one of you. Bye-bye, everybody.